Welcome back to the show. This is your favorite host, Namdi, and you're watching the Empathy is Money show. As always, I emphasize the need to walk in other people's shows, choose, understand their struggles. The big buzzword is empathy now, if you haven't noticed. And I think that the revolutionary shift happened when we started to understand human nature. The old view that we are essentially self-interested or self-absorbed people or creatures is being completely obliterated and replaced with the fact with the understanding that we as human beings we are wired for empathy we're wired for companionship we're wired for, to, for social cooperation and we're wired to work together mutually uh, for the mutual benefits of others now on the fringes uh, on the edges you do have those crazy people but uh for the most part we do care about each other all right but that's not the point of the show today. The show today was for, for me to bring you joys of marriage and uh, wedding bells ringing on the, on the Ethereum blockchain in the form of NFTs. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, the first couple uh, employees of Coinbase have tied the knot on the blockchain. What did they do? This couple obviously decided they wanted to make their this event, a special event in their lives, different from everybody from you know what we're commonly used to. Um, I don't think the fact that they're Coinbase em employees really matter to this story, uh, other than the fact that it, you know if you're if you work for Coinbase, then clearly you're very very plugged in into crypto and blockchain technology. So this NFT is all the buzz. NFT is how is a way through tech, through blockchain, that you can digitize physical assets and make them non-fungible, which means that you can't, it can't be uh, dupli duplicated or there can't be another version of it. It can't be copied. So these people, they got married, they, they're Jewish, People. So they got married in the uh, Jewish traditional ceremony. And in addition to that, they wanted to add some spice to it. You know, they wanted to make it different. So what they did uh, was they created, they minted their a virtual uh, ring on, uh, on an NFT. They tokenized their virtual ring and, and made it an NFT. They also added a really cute um, visual to it. Which, I, which is really pretty. You can look it up on Etherscan. The name of the token is Tabat, the Hebrew word for ring. And right now, if you searched Etherscan for the word Tabat token, you their, their name will come up. And well, actually, it will just show that there are only two rings minted, one for the couple and there will never be any one of those rings ever minted again. It's, it's just beautiful. These guys have like pretty much cemented themselves in the history. It's always first mover when it comes to history. Um, you know, for years to come now, if, you, if that word Tabat token ever gets searched on Etherscan, it, it's gonna bring up their names as the first minted ring ever. Um, I think that's really cool. I think it further promotes the non-fungible token space and uh, how it's going to revolutionize everything as we know it. I'm uh, getting deep into it because I want to also partake and participate and be on this train as it rides into the future. Um, anyway, you can read more up on it. You can look them up. The name of the couple is Rebecca Rose and Peter Kaczynski. And, you know, they tweeted about it too. I think it's cute really really cute congratulations guys congratulations on getting married happy wed luck and also congratulations on uh, making tech history all right my faithful audience thank you for watching uh subscribe to the channel leave a comment share the video and i'll see you next time